Hello world and welcome to my channel. This very short video is on a the um, installation of solar on the roof of my work ute um, and it's to charge up the King's AGM 98 Ampere AG, AGM deep cycle battery that I have in the battery box I just installed to run my brass monkey fridge and it's just a quick review on that as well it's three years old now and I'm happy with it hope you like this video if you do please subscribe and give me a thumbs up cheers That's the size of it, that's a bag that came in. This is the half of the panel. I disconnected. There are the hinges. And that's the other half of the uh, the panel, which is 125 watts. Power. That's the panel there. You can imagine the weight of it when there's two of them together. This is a bit of a plug for my business, a share of my son. Towns Electrical and Appliance Repairs. I specialize in the uh, small jobs and electronics things like washing machines, fridges, um, most of the things that electricians hate. So yeah, I specialize in those whereas the rest of our, our company, in, um, the other tradesmen and the apprentices, um, our son control uh, helps them and, um, and we install split systems and TV, phone, internet, white goods air conditioning, um, you, th you name it, we do it. So yeah, this is the, um, the solar I put on the roof, just up there like that. It's half of a fixed por a portable panel, it's a 250 watt portable panel that I made in half because it was just too damn heavy to lift at my age I just stopped using it for a couple of years I've had it for over four years and I just stopped using it because it's just too damn heavy so I went to solar blankets instead but I've decided I found a use for it by putting half of it up here the other half I might either do something with or give it away to a friend it looks quite neat up there and tidy. That's the solar controller. It's a waterproof one. Connection box through King's uh, brackets. It wouldn't fit this 40 mil bar, so I had to drill out the hole, make it bigger, and then put a, nut, a bolt with a lock nut on it. The other one I threaded through, won't move. So I took the cable down here, through here, through a compression gland. And it's just sitting loosely in the floor of the, here, through here into the other terminal of the battery box. So this one runs a brass monkey fridge. This one is an input for the solar. At the moment it's putting in 13.2 volts. Um, I used it last week, charged a little bit in the middle of the day. And I only just finished putting the solar in late yesterday afternoon. So it'll be charging up every day. This is 
the uh, brass monkey fridge. At the moment it's off. Excellent fridge. Um, had it for th nearly three years, just a, a week or so off three years. Um, and I would definitely recommend the 15 litre one. Um, maybe the bigger ones, I'm not sure they have LG compressors in them and they also have a, a fridge a lid warps on them. I've heard my mate's got one. Um, yeah, so, but I'm really happy with this battery box sitting right here. Um, and it runs the brass monkey fridge really good during the day. Now I've got solar to charge it up and I'm happy with it. So Yeah, this brass monkey fridge. It's still working very very good. It's been in several Utilities and I go take it camping and sits in the back of my ute and it gets rained on and everything And it works well on the, my uh, other ute I go camping in Thirteen point two is pumping out. So theoretically, it was a two hundred and fifty watt panel. It's the specifications on it. Probably upside down. And there I had to redo the connections because I was using it without the solar controller. I pumped it straight into the CTEX um, MPPT controller. And that's it on the roof. These are the King's stainless steel brackets. might put a bit of silicon on these screws here they might work loose so a dab of silicon I'm gonna lock, the, lock them in place and then I just got a cable tie this back to there and this is a compression gland well I hope you like this video if you do Please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. Cheers.